Good morning, everybody. Today is so exciting. Tech is like my favourite part of any show. So this week is very exciting for me. If you don't know me, hello, I'm Alicia and I play Frenchy in Greece. And this week is our tech week and we open on Friday. Today is Tuesday, Tuesday the 9th of April. Yeah, it's our first day in the theatre. We are starting tech this evening. It's our first tech session. The scheduling for today is basically we need to get into Mike's wigs and costumes. Sorry. We have to get into Mike's wigs and... <laughs> we have to get into Mike's wigs and costumes at 6.15 and then be ready on stage to start from the top of the show at 7. For anybody who doesn't know what a tech week is, it's basically where the cast, the crew, you know, sound, lighting, wigs, wardrobe, everyone finally comes together and goes through the show extremely slowly, like literally minute by minute basically and sort of plots the show, if that makes sense. Like um, the lights will know when their lighting cues are and like they'll also program the whole thing. I mean, Greece is a little bit different because they've done it before. So like they know exactly what lights they want on where and like how the whole thing works. So I think it will be very smooth. We've only got three days to do it, two and a half days to do it. Um, but like I said, it's because everybody pretty much knows what they're doing. So I think it's gonna be more for cast and wardrobe and just to make sure everything runs smoothly. And if there's, you know, we've got like a new DSM who's gonna be um, calling the show, which is when basically she sits, I mean, I'll go through all of this on vlogs to come, but our DSM, deputy stage manager, like sits and it is like on a headset which connects to the lights who are at the back and she's telling them like when to go and stuff and she's new to the production so it will be for her and also for us to work on our quick changes and for new members of the cast to like see the set for the first time and yeah just to basically get the whole show on the road. <laughs> the reason why I'm so excited is because I get to put on my wig for the first time today. Um, when I put it on last time, I was a bit like scared and shocked because it was like not styled. So if you think like straight hair coming out of a wig with no styling, I looked like one of those weird trolls. But since I've seen the wig and they've put a little bit of like baby pink in it and they've styled it, it's really cute. So I'm really excited to try that on for the first time. And then also just seeing everybody in costume, it's like completely different to just being in a rehearsal room. So yeah, really excited. Plan for today is I have a physio appointment at 2 p.m. So although we're not called until six, I do have physio at the theatre at two. So I can take my time to get into my dressing room and uh, yeah, just have a lovely day. I'm really excited. Just wanted to show you my current packing situation. Let me just open the curtains in here. Okay, so most people have already packed up their lives and moved on tour to Bromley. I live like a half an hour drive from Bromley, so I was like, uh, let's not go on tour right now. But we do go to Dublin in like two weeks and I feel that I'm gonna have very little free time to get anything done, so I have started. The task at hand is a large one, honestly. Okay, I'll show you my situation. So this is our spare room and all my stuff is just in like piles on the floor. <laughs> um, I did start a little bit of like clothes stuff yesterday, um, but mainly I wanted to sort out all my bits and bobs, like all of the stuff that I showed you like in my travel essentials the other week, um, all my toiletries and stuff. So I've got this big suitcase um, and I'm also allowed a smaller suitcase and my Cabin Max backpack for the flight. Normally on a tour you wouldn't have any luggage restrictions but obviously because we're flying straight away we have like a weight allowance and everything like that. But yeah normally it's just like whatever you feel that you can carry on the train or like put in your car if you're driving or whatever. But this tour I've said I'm gonna pack as little as possible because having to like lug around two suitcases and a backpack that are really really heavy just makes your life so much harder so I'm just gonna like really try and behave myself in terms of packing um but yeah this is where we're at, at the moment i actually think like this is what shoes i'm gonna take and that's it like a pair of heels pair of boots my sandals and then my gym trainers slash everyday trainers i'm just gonna do that because i just can't be bothered i was gonna do a pack with me video but 
this has been like so stressful and overwhelming already so I feel like I'm just gonna keep updating you like throughout the vlogs on like what I'm doing. This towel and this dressing gown I'm hoping to be able to take to the theatre and maybe like put on the truck like in one of the wardrobe trundles or something like that because I don't feel like that will fit in my suitcase but I'm gonna assess the situation when I go to the theatre today and see whether they think they'll have room for those things because they are essentials for when I shower at the theatre, etc. These two bags are like my theatre essentials that I am taking. Um, I'm hoping that it will fit in the tour box. Basically when you do a show on tour, they give you like a little box that is basically all the stuff that you need for the show, like makeup. Obviously I've got my Crocs in there which I'll be walking around in backstage, water bottle, and then in this Lululemon bag. If you've watched me for a while, you'll know about this bag. This is sort of like my, warm up slash wellness bag. I basically have like my massage gun, my physio band, some refills of the saline solution that I use for my nebulizer. My nebulizer is also in here. Yeah, I've just got like tiger balm, lip balm, just like physio tape for my knees and stuff. Just things that I would probably take down to warm up and do there. I've also got like a massage ball. All of this is linked in my Amazon storefront if you want to have a look. But yeah, I'm really hoping that all of this stuff will fit in my tour box because I'm kind of not willing to put it in my suitcase. <laughs> so we'll see what kind of tour box we get given at the theatre and then I will assess the situation and see if I need to get rid of anything. But I'll show you more in depth all that I've got in this bag when I get to the theatre and I start setting up my dressing room space. I'm so excited. Okay. Gosh, it's been... A long time since we did a little car vlog. Thankfully, my little car's still going. Story about this car, I've had it since I could learn to drive. So like since I was 17 and I'm now 26. It was my birthday on Saturday. We had a lovely time. Um, I never celebrate my birthday. So it was just so lovely to have all my friends in one place and just, yeah, I felt really special and really loved and it was um, a really gorgeous time. So very much enjoyed that. Anyway, off on a tangent had my car that long so I feel like she's gonna die very very soon anyway as I said I can drive to Bromley in literally like half an hour so very very happy about that let's get on the road I'm so excited I'm not sure this is a normal thing to be so excited about tech because it can be quite mind-numbing and very slow and repetitive but for me it's like one of my favorite things ever All right let's go oh my goodness I had an app nightmare so i drove up to like the back of the theater where sort of all of the trucks are loading and everything and i thought this doesn't look right i'm sure when i came here last time because i toured here with my first tour little miss sunshine i'm sure there's a car park like around the front and so i drove all the way around the town because it's all one way so that was about a 15 minute drive got there and there's no cars allowed like past the front of the theater so i was like okay that must have been another theater that i was thinking of so then i did the 15 minute drive all the way back around again so it's taken me about an hour to get here but we're here now and i'm parked underneath the theater let's get into a dressing room <laughs> okay this is the dressing room for the week it's a lovely big one i'm in with the ensemble girls which is lovely Here's my name. Where should we put me? Emerald and Dina. I kind of want to be in the corner, honestly. We love a little corner seat. Or do I go by the sink? <laughs> choices, choices. I might go here. I've got an extra little bit. That's cheeky, isn't it? Here we go. They've also spelt my name wrong. Ta da! Right, let's get unpacking. All right, let's get started. Let's see what these lights are like. Ooh, they're quite nice. Okay, right, cue a little time lapse of me setting up my space. Voila! I feel like I could definitely do this better actually. Let's put him down there. <laughs> so if you've watched the other Frenchy Friday vlogs, this is the picture that was in the locker and I refused to let him go because, yeah, a lot of love for him. And <laughs> I used to say that he looked like Sam, who is this guy, who was my partner in Greece yes uh, yesterday, last year. Um, 
Yeah. Okay, so we've gone for a very minimal setup this time. This photo I need to get blue tack for because I just don't want to be struggling. <laughs> so I've just come out of the physio. Um, I went in for my appointment a bit earlier than scheduled. The physio today basically told me that he doesn't think that it is patella tracking disorder, which is what the physio last week told me. So I'm now just a little bit lost. He said, oh, you might have it slightly, but maybe the work that you've been doing over the past couple of weeks has helped it and it's now not tracking in a way that's problematic. So yeah, anyway, what's happening right now with it? It looks fine and um, we'll see if I get any more problems moving forward, I guess. <laughs> anyway, I'm now starving. I'm gonna go out and get some food, I think. I've actually got no Wi-Fi down here at the moment, so I'm gonna see if I can get a Wi-Fi password. Um, but yeah, it's now half past one, and I've got until six, so it's late. Need to do my makeup at some point. But yeah, very happy with my desk set up. She looks cute. Okay, I'm back. Right, so. There is a little right outside, should have remembered. A little snack run happened. Got some carrots and some hummus. Um, some soy and balsamic vinegar pea snacks. I don't know what they're gonna be like, but we'll try. Some fruit and nut protein bars. And guess what this is, everybody? Three, two, one. It's a Pepsi Max! Um, and then I also went to Kokoro, 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 <laughs> and I got vegetable gozer and basically like a salmon set. Bloody stunning. Yeah, I was meant to be going for lunch with Sario and Jaden, but they're still at their digs. Oh my god, look. Here is the show relay. You can see the set. Looks like they're kind of on maybe just going into beauty school dropout. Not really too sure. Um, it looks amazing though. Mmm. I now have like four hours and I'm not actually sure what I'm gonna do. Definitely need to do my makeup at some point. Yeah, other than that, I'm just gonna chill. That's dangerous, that Kokoro being right outside. Not good. Everyone, it's me, Jaden Tyrone, the one and only, Savio Solomon, it's me, Jackie Dylan Wong. Gordon Jones. <laughs> Alicia Barnes. Oh, no, no, you, you almost forgot what my name was then. Yeah. <laughs> you were like... This is our space for warm up. Here I am with the iconic George Michaelidis. Uh, Michaelidis. 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 Might get shy in front of the cameras. Molly. Molly. Let's just cover this. Please. We're being real good tonight. When you put this out and you, we've been around with you, just know. It's going to be embarrassing. No football <laughs> talk on here, please. <laughs> Hi vlog. <laughs> you look gorgeous. The light is really good. Which is where we get to know where everything is on the set. Good. Okay, this makes sense. Yeah. Upstage doors, this is where we're going to work on some masking. Like cover us so we're not seen as we're running by. Upstage left, everybody. Stage left, prop shelf. We have burger bars, etc., along here. It's a bed. It's Charlie! There's the trampoline. The poor drummer. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
I just come back from the stage to this. Oh my goodness, how gorgeous are these? Oh, that's me on the end. <laughs> and then I've also got my little box. Oh, it's got a towel in. Yeah, it's just a towel with my name on it. Sorry, I was doing a rubbish job of filming then. Here we are. My name written on it. A bra, knickers and some pink socks. Right, here we go. First wig prep of the contract. I'm gonna just try and do the one that I did last year because it was so easy. Just a massive pin curl on the top of my head. Let's see whether she's gonna work. Work! Oh, look! Oh. <laughs> I know, we've got one of these slippers too. Oh my god, they've got lips. Stop! No, no, no. I know, no, how no. freaking cute. Cutest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> little gremlin. <laughs> I'm such a little gremlin about this stuff. <laughs> Have you just done that just now? Yeah. This is. I need to get a shift on. <gasps> this is the name of the game. Towel. I know. Thank God. Oh, slippers. Oh, in your little. Oh, oh. In your oh I do. Oh my God. Yeah. God, I've got oh. really well little pants. This is the best day ever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really in my pants. Right, really where's my little box? Okay, yeah. I'm going to try and do yeah. this now. I don't know. Men's night, you're getting a little unicorn. <laughs> yeah, but this is literally it for me. Um, mine is uh, And it's a sleigh. We got the email today, didn't we? Here we go. There we go. <clears throat> Damn, she quit. Took her in. She said, get it in. Okay, right. No, wait. Oh, my God. <laughs> Guys, I'm so oh, Everybody's having I'm sad. I'm Oh, you're 6.25. You can supervise mine. I'm not so excited. Other than um, Greece, I've never worn my mic in my wig. No, I did one shoe oh, that had it like that. But back. again, they were so much bulkier. They weren't yeah. nice. Like, it's just so neat. Yeah. yeah. Actually, we didn't have it. It was just coloured to the same. Yeah, yeah. I am that soul scared. You're a bit of a thin up top. Cigar in that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so just treat it like a little man. Yeah. yeah. Cool. So, as they fall, there's no way. I love how you came in the table. Catching. Oh my god, you are in full pink as well. I know. Super deep style. Yeah, literally. It's just so cute. To be honest, it's easy. It's so that can't be all got some resistance. Yeah, that's all good. Yeah. You could probably just even the cut the curl off and I don't cut the curl off. So you can have a request. I'm getting it out. Yeah. I got use it last time, but I'm also like it's better for a little like this thing over top. I was gonna say. So cute. I love her. Love her. You've got a little authentic walk away from the camera there, it's nice. Hi. <laughs> Thank you guys. Be joking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glued in, so I'm just trying oh, to she's not getting out. Hold out. it down. It's part of you. Yeah. I actually love it. I love it. She's kind of cute. Oh, nice this is our opening costumes. Yeah. You can't really see. Let's oh, put yeah. it down. You look so beautiful. You look so cute. I love it. I'm giving like I was a boxer in a past life. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is funny. Tech day one. Just been given these blue earrings. They're really cute. Hey, here's Jen. Who are your earrings too? What color are they? You got um, kind of yellow. Thing. They're yeah, pretty! Yeah. Yeah. Pretty wow. Jen. <laughs> but she's giving tomboy. Yeah, she is. She's giving. Yeah. She is. Look at the glasses. Oh. Do they make me look smarter? <laughs> now everyone's just sound checking. It's currently Kieran as Doody. Basically, what you have to do is just say a load of your lines out loud um, so they can adjust the levels of your mic. First day of tech done. We didn't even make it to the end of summer nights, so yes, we've got a long way to go, but it went, it went well. 
and uh, seeing my costume and my wig was just excellent. Good morning, everybody. Another day. It is now, what day even is it? It's Wednesday, I think. Yeah, it's Wednesday. And uh, yeah, we've got kind of not even a full day today. We've got from one till 10. So yeah, I think they're hoping to get quite a good chunk done today, but then tomorrow we have nine till 10. So a big old 13 hour day. Yesterday was so crazy and like, I was so excited. You can probably see from the vlog, I was just editing it this morning and I'm just like, gee, like, geez, <laughs> a Frenchism, but um, yeah, I'm just so grateful to be where I am and like the people are just, amazing and the way that everybody has each other's backs it's just a really beautiful company so i'm just really having a good time uh, so today i think we'll be picking up from uh summer nights i believe and then going as far as we can but i will keep you up to date through the day all right we're in wigs oh that's Ooh. a two-way door um and our yes been glued again um and our dressing gowns Huh? Um, because we have to. Is it this way? No. Uh, uh, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's no admitted. Admitted. Sorry, personal life. Oh, we've not even got to social yet. Um, we have to change at the side of the stage. Um, it's basically to make it easier for the dressers who aren't with us every single week to navigate the whole costume situation. Okay, so we just teched Marty's bedroom, which is Freddie my love. I'm in some pajamas, but I couldn't get any footage. And now this is the part in the show where. The pink ladies and I, apart from Rizzo, have like a 20 minute break. And I think by that point we'll probably be on our tea break. So I've decided to get into my next costume anyway. I'll show you how cute is this t-shirt. And I've got pink jeans on this time. And I've got my pink trainers. And then I've got like a pink leather jacket as well. But yeah, it's going pretty well right now. We're just about to get onto Grease Lightning, which I'm going to say is like halfway through act one maybe just over half okay so these are the cigarettes that we use they basically have like a battery and then like some sort of like juice i guess and it's just water vapor like there's nothing in them but um if you've watched grease ever you'll know that frenchie has to french inhale which is how she gets her nickname frenchie and i've been really practicing it guys but not the best. You'll hear grease lightning in the background here. <clears throat> so basically, I have to have it in my mouth and then breathe it out and breathe it up my nose. And so many people have been trying to teach me how to do it and it's just really failing. Oh yeah, they're gonna stop. Okay, <laughs> sorry George. So, this is, this is where we're at the moment. Also, with an usual cigarette, you, I assume that you'd be able to like get more smoke in your mouth so that it's more obvious what's happening but with these you really can't get much out of them so i'm going to show you and maybe we'll have like a progress thing Sorry. no i'm just i'm just showing my pathetic attempt of a french in Hi. <laughs> you look so cute i need to get my dress going in okay was that it I think I'm fucking. <laughs> I can't tell whether I'm doing it or not. Can I watch? <sighs> Is it going up my nose or not? Yeah. Ish. <laughs> it kind of goes up the side a little bit. <laughs> so, if anybody's got any tips on how to French inhale, they would be greatly appreciated because this is a nightmare. I mean, it's from far away anyway, isn't it? So, so just to give you a realistic idea of what, oh my God, I look crazy, um, of what tech is like, I have not done anything since four o'clock and it's now 11 minutes past seven. So um, it can be very, very slow sometimes. It does mean that I can watch the little bits that I wouldn't usually get to watch. So this is basically what Say it's it. like. <laughs> Jaden's playing up, but no, we're basically no, like no, just no, stood, no, like working through bits really slowly, um, working on formations and uh, also like putting little spikes on the floor for the different pieces of set. So a spike kind of looks like 
I don't know whether there's one that I can show you. Yeah, so it looks like this. It's just a little piece of tape. And they're all like colour coordinated for each scene. So when you come and watch, if you look at the floor really closely, you'll see all of the different little like corners of tape, which are the different set pieces throughout uh, the show. <laughs> <laughs> and it is 10 to 10 since I've done for the day. Oh my god, it's just been Joe Gash is behind me. Oh my, it's been the longest. Honestly. We didn't actually get through I just wish I Act had, 1. I, just can't, I wish I had time for the vlog. <laughs> Disappointing. I think everybody was hoping that we'd get through Act 1. But uh, alas, we did not. We didn't. <laughs> we did not. <sighs> just got home and collapsed on the bed. <laughs> I'm so tired and we're in at 9am in the morning so um, I'm going to take my makeup off, get in the shower and go to sleep before another day. So yeah, tomorrow we'll set from the end of Act 1 and then move into the jive. I love my hand jive dress so I'll make sure to show you guys. Um, and I hope you're enjoying this vlog so far and if you are please subscribe. And I will keep making this sort of content along the way on tour. But yeah, good night, and I'll see you in the morning. Oh. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> I'm not crying, <laughs> I promise. <laughs> I literally woke up 20 minutes ago. And do you know when you're like, I don't know how I'm going to open my eyes right now. Your alarm's going off, and you're like, yeah, my eyes have just gone really watery as I've come into the bright outdoors. Oh my gosh, it is, what time? Five to seven, and I'm so tired, and I've just put into my um, Apple Maps the route, and it's gonna take an hour and 23 minutes, which is so much longer than it usually does, because obviously it's rush hour. So, I've gotta get on the road. Turns out Apple Maps was lying, and I've got here, with like an hour to spare, so that's all good. Um, I'm just gonna pop to Greg's now and get myself some breakfast, maybe some lunch too, to save me going out in the lunch break. Honestly, like I wish I had the time or like mental capacity to be meal prepping and going for a food shop and everything like that, but tech week, I just give myself some slack. Sorry, I'm going up loads of stairs. Yeah, I just give myself some slack and um, I tend to just eat out pretty much the whole time we're in tech. Here's our theatre, the Churchill Theatre this week and next week when you're watching this. And on the front, you'll spot a very familiar face, Trixie. <laughs> okay, I got myself a ham and cheese baguette for later, Lucas Aid Zero, and a sausage bean and cheese melt for now. I'm repping the old grease merch today. It says Trixie. <laughs> Um, right, I'm just going to do my makeup. I'm going to do a vlog while I'm on tour, a more in-depth um, look at my stage makeup. That's something that you guys are interested in. But for now, I'm just going to slap it on my face and uh, get ready for a really long day. <laughs> okay, makeup is done. It's now 9am and we're ready for warm-up. You know, it's another day. It's now <laughs> in the morning. Um, it's just, I'm so tired. Like... <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I, you know, some people think this musical theatre laughs hard, but let me tell you, my name's Alicia, and I am... Joe, well, I, don't say that, don't say it. All right, here we go. So this is my prom dress. I think I'm going to have to get a different configuration for my bra straps. How cute is she? Um, I need to get a headscarf on, but they're not sure what one they want to put me in yet. Um, because I just look like a, a little bit of a smurf at the moment. Um, but she's so cute, isn't she? Love her. This is the new headscarf, everyone. It's pink, you can't really see. This is my beauty school costume. <laughs> How cute is that? I think I need to tie this another time. These are our Jan's basement costumes. They're such a sleigh. We're really a bitch, isn't it? Yeah, come on. So like, we need to get a picture in these. Yeah. <laughs> We've just come off dinner. And uh, now we're still going. I had um, sushi. Only from Tesco, though, but 
Oh, this woman is a sushi roll. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I know. I can't camera. stop. Um, it's seven o'clock, and it's our final tech session. Let's go. Let's go. Right, this is my finale outfit. I am so buzzing about this one. If you've followed me for a while, you'll see why. <laughs> and I've got these like high-waisted pink uh, trousers. Let me show you. Really, really cute. I love it. How are you feeling? Tired? Oh, I'm so tired. <laughs> so tired. I'm delirious bed. now. Oh. oh, hi. Come hi. on, Patty. <laughs> Hello everyone, we've just finished our final day of tech. We actually didn't make it all the way to the end of the show, which is mad, but we do only have the Mega Mix left to tech, so that is fine. I'm sure that'll happen at some point in the morning. This is actually the last little part of this vlog, so thank you so much for watching. I hope it's been uh, informative and entertaining and you've enjoyed it. And if you have, please like it and subscribe for more stuff like this. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Lots of love.